Ever since Windows 10 was released, Microsoft has brought a number of updates for it. There has been the anniversary update, the creators update, and recently, the company unveiled the new fall creators update. These updates have brought numerous cool features to the operating system. And this also means that there are several hidden features and tricks in Windows 10 that you might have missed out on. Well, that's what we are talking about today. What's up guys, this is Rupesh from bbomb.com and today I'm going to show you 8 cool Windows 10 tricks and features that are fairly unknown. So without any further ado, let's get started. There are situations when you get up from your office desk to grab a cup of coffee, but you forget to lock your laptop. Well, you wouldn't want your co-workers to take a peek inside your laptop, would you? Well, this is where the cool new dynamic lock feature comes into play. Dynamic lock automatically locks down your PC when you're away. Yes, to enable it, you'll first have to pair your phone to your PC via Bluetooth. Then you can just head to settings, here go to accounts, and then go to sign in options. Here scroll down below and just check the option under dynamic lock. Now whenever you move away from your laptop with your phone, your laptop will automatically be locked when your phone is out of the computer's Bluetooth range. Do note that this feature might only be available on the Windows 10 Creators update. If you have a high-end Windows laptop with an SSD, you must have faced storage problems once in a while. Thankfully, Windows 10 brings a great storage manager. In the system page of settings, go to the storage option. Here you will find all the drives in your PC. You can just click on a drive to get the specific details around what's using up storage on your device. So you can remove files that you don't really need. There are also temporary files and you can just click on it to delete temporary files, downloaded files, empty the recycle bin and files from a previous Windows version. If you don't want to go through the hassle of cleaning up these files every now and then, you can enable Storage Sense, which deletes temporary files from apps and files in recycle bin that have been there for over 30 days. Now this should surely free up some space for you. If you tend to use your laptop for long working hours, especially at night, you might have felt a little discomfort in your eyes. Well, that's because of the blue light in the display. While Windows users have used Flux that filters out the blue light from the display, Windows now offers a native solution dubbed Nightlight. You can just head to Windows settings, here go to system then display. You should see the Nightlight option here. Just enable it and you will see the color temperature of the screen change to a more warmer tone. You can also personalize things if you want. You can schedule night light from sunset to sunrise or set a custom time. This should definitely make viewing the display at night much more easy on the eyes. Do note that this feature requires Windows 10 Creators Update to be installed on your PC. Checking notifications on your phone while you're working on your laptop isn't a great experience. As you might have guessed, Yes, you can get your phone notifications on your Windows laptop. You just need to install the Cortana app on your Android smartphone. Then set up Cortana with the same Microsoft account that you use on your PC. Once it's set up, tap on the profile icon in the Cortana app. Here go to settings and tap on the option sync settings. Now just enable notifications for missed calls, messages, apps, etc. Once done, open up your Windows PC and go to Cortana settings. Here click on the notifications and enable send notifications between devices. You can also click on manage notifications to make sure notification syncing from your phone is enabled. Once done, you will see varied notifications from your Android smartphone. And you will even be able to respond to messages and calls right from your PC. Now that is cool isn't it? Teaching someone the steps to do a particular task on Windows through texting or a call can be very annoying. The best way is through images. Well, not many people know that Windows includes a cool steps recorder feature that well, records all your steps. You can just launch step recorder through Cortana and a small window should open up. Just hit the start record button to record the steps you want to show someone. For instance, I'm enabling the dark theme. 
Once done, click stop and Windows will show you the steps you just did. You can review the steps and even add any comments while recording the steps. This should come very handy, trust me. You must have used sticky notes on your Windows PC. But did you know that they have a really intelligent feature? Just open sticky notes by searching it on Cortana and in the sticky note, hit the menu button and then click on the gear icon at the bottom. Here just enable the insights option. Once done, you can just write a note like get the car checked tomorrow and you will see the tomorrow highlighted. You can just click on it to save the note as a reminder in Cortana. You can even specify the time in the note itself. That's not all. You can even note down phone numbers and then dial it through sticky notes. You can also use it to check stock value, note websites and open it directly. Well, sticky notes just got more useful. Emojis have become an integral part of our conversation on the internet. Sadly, there's no way to type in an emoji easily from the hardware keyboard. The good news is, you can send emojis from the on-screen Windows keyboard. Just right-click on the taskbar and tick the Show Touch Keyboard option. Now, the touch keyboard will be available to you at all times and you can just open it, go to the emoji page and send as many emojis as you want. Microsoft brought some great news for Linux geeks when it announced that a special version of the Bash shell is part of Windows 10. However, if you want to use it, you'll have to enable it first. So first go to Windows settings and head to update and security. Here go to the for developers option and enable the developer mode. Then open control panel and click on programs and then programs and features. Here click on the option to turn Windows features on or off from the left pane. In the new window that opens up, enable the option that says Windows Subsystem for Linux. Then you'll have to restart your PC. Once your PC restarts, search for Bash which will open a command prompt window. Here you'll have to enter Y to install Ubuntu first. Once it's done, you will be able to use Bash shell as if you were on a computer with Ubuntu. Lastly, keyboard shortcuts are the best way to use a Windows computer and there are some great keyboard shortcuts you can use on Windows 10. Well, you can use Windows plus print screen to save a screenshot of the full screen. You can use Windows plus shift plus S to capture a part of the screen. You can also snap windows with ease via the Windows plus arrow keys. Another keyboard shortcut that I really like is the ability to press F2 to rename files and folders. There are some great keyboard shortcuts out there and you need to check out a video on the same to become a keyboard ninja. Well, those were some really cool Windows 10 tricks and hidden features that I think are amazing. What about you? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tech videos. Well, that's me signing off. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.